So I was just at this mastermind meeting and there's a company here in our kind of business, the, the publishing business, the direct marketing business, the online marketing business, that is a billion dollar company. They do over a billion dollars in sales, which is crazy. So I learned something. It's like, I, I, I had this thought like, how much bigger is that business than my business? And so I learned something. So here's my phone. And if we go like this, that's a thousand, that's a hundred thousand, that's a million. That's a hundred million, a hundred million dollars. And the funny thing is this, I can't even, I'm pushing the zero. The iPhone doesn't go beyond a hundred million. It's pretty amazing. So then I learned that if you turn this sideways, you can get, you can get another zero in there. So let me put another zero in there. So that is what a billion looks like that this company is doing a billion dollars in sales and just being around them they're, they're mere mortals they are they're like people running it and they're running a similar business to mine and in fact there's a lot of things that the way they're doing it is not even as sophisticated as the way I'm doing things and my peers are doing things. There's stuff I know that they're not doing that could increase their business in a big way. And yet they're at a billion dollars. And I've never really been around people with a billion dollar business in our kind of markets. You know, I've hung out with some other people who have some huge businesses in like other markets that seem like, you know, you hang out with uh, Richard Branson and he's got these huge like airlines and stuff like that. And that makes sense. But like the idea that someone could have a billion dollar business in my kind of business is just amazing. I mean, I, I hang out with people with hundred million dollar businesses, but not billion dollar businesses. And it's not that like a billion dollar business is better than my business, but it just, it reset my idea of what the possibilities are. But then I got to thinking, like if I had a time machine and if I could go back 10 years, so if I went back 10 years from, you know, back into the past and I could sit down with my current self, so my 10 year ago self could sit down with my current self, then I would think that what I am doing now is inconceivable, is almost unbelievable. The size of my business, the growth of my business, the size of my team, the impact I make in the world would have been inconceivable to my 10 year ago self. Just as inconceivable as right now thinking about this billion dollar business, which is a lot bigger than mine, way bigger than mine. And it seems inconceivable, but I know where I am now is, was inconceivable to me 10 years ago. And that's the way it works. If you're looking at me possibly, or one of my peers, or, or someone else and saying what they are doing is inconceivable. If you just show up and do the work and you, and you have the right, I mean, it's not just doing the work, it's having the right process, the right method, the right strategy, putting one foot in front of the other, continually getting better, you can achieve amazing things. You know, there's, I forget who said this or exactly how they said this, but most people overestimate what, they're, what they can do in the next day, in the next week, in the next month, even in the next year. So they tend to overestimate their capabilities in the short term but they way, way, way underestimate their capabilities in the long term. I do these videos each week for you and they're always about the long term. They're never about the tactic that's gonna put this button on your website. You're gonna make a ton of money. All of a sudden the money's gonna fly into your bank account. You'll never see me pushing that. There are really cool tactics out there and sometimes I'll tell you about them and sometimes I'll teach my students about them, but 
the big picture strategy is what wins over the long run and just knowing and trusting that you can create something amazing if you keep focused on getting better and you understand it's a long game. The long game always wins. Will I have a, bil a billion dollar business 10 years from now? I don't know. Probably not. Do I even want a billion dollar business? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe so. Who knows? But coming out to this meeting has sort of reset my idea of what the possibilities are. And just reflecting on how far I've come. Why don't you reflect on where you've come? And then take that and project it into the future. And you'll see what your life could become. So I'm Jeff Walker. Wherever you're watching this, scroll down. Leave a comment for me. Tell me about where things could go. Not next month, but five years or ten years from now. And let's go get them this week.